Today in entertainment news, a celebrity mashup you probably didn't expect, and an actor has a religious experience he didn't expect. Coming up next for your entertainment. I don't know if you fully understand what we're in for tonight, but you will be very happy you have this experience. Bono and the Edge. Let's go. U2 is releasing Songs of Surrender, an album with 40 of their classic songs reimagined and re-recorded. To celebrate, they invited David Letterman to visit Ireland for the first time. The result is the film Bono and the Edge, a sort of homecoming with Dave Letterman. The bandmates reflect on their 45 plus year friendship, show Dave around Dublin, and put on a unique intimate concert, all captured by Oscar winning filmmaker Morgan Neville. The film premieres on Disney Plus on St. Patrick's Day, March 17th, the same day the album comes out. You will find forgiveness and freedom right here. Kelsey Grammer says the role of a pastor in Jesus' revolution was like an answer to a no prayer. Trips. When I first read the script, I'd spent the night before asking God or whatever, at 3 a.m., I'm sitting there thinking, I want to do something important. I want to do something that has a, a, a deeper value than just like entertaining, making somebody laugh or making somebody cry, doing what you usually do. I want something that has maybe some moment to it. And this script came the next day. I read it and said, okay, that was it. All right, thank you very much. <laughs> this is good. Jesus Revolution is in theaters this weekend. For your entertainment, I'm Naya Robinson.